my older brother, he's five and a half years older. In my eyes growing up, he hung the moon. He was my everything. We had the normal, you know, silly things that brothers and sisters do to each other. And he did some pretty good ones and I did some pretty good ones. Like he fell asleep once, I painted his toenails and I wouldn't give him nail polish remover. He was going on a date. The kid must have been like 16. I didn't understand that she would see his toenails, you know, or he pinned me down once and made me say the F word into a tape recorder, which I'm sure he taped over right away and blackmailed me into making him tea and toast forever. And as far as like looking to him for protection or him being protective of me to the outside world, yes, he was. There was a time in kindergarten I was scared of this kid and he intervened and made sure that the kid who was older than me stayed away from me. Like he didn't beat him up or anything, but he was there, he took up. So fast forward when I disclosed to him that I had been sexually assaulted I thought for sure he would believe me. I thought he would be horrified and upset for me. I think I was about, I don't know, like 20 when I told him, and this had happened when I was 12, and all he did was call me a liar. When I go backwards and I think about the fact that neither one of us took up for the other where my mother was concerned. I never threw him under the bus. I don't think he threw me under the bus either. But if the choice was to stand with me or me stand with him against her, that was never going to happen. One, because she had us so emotionally spin, spun out, like we were completely, you know, in her control, mind control, that whole thing. And the other reason is because we were also terrified of her. Becoming an adult and going no contact with my mother if you had asked me who's the one person you think will stand by you, I would have said it was my brother because I didn't understand the dynamic and what had been done to us. It's what made it that much harder to not having that understanding because I grieved something I didn't even expect to lose, someone I didn't expect to lose.